This weekend, I want to talk about when waiting is hard. And when isn't waiting hard? When you want something. You want something right now. You don't want to wait for it. Well, it has been said by St. Vincent de Paul, he said, The affairs of God are accomplished little by little and almost without notice. The Spirit of God is neither violent nor hasty. I can remember one time I was at a motorcycle dealer and I wanted this motorcycle in front of me on the floor. I mean, I was so excited I was vibrating. You know how that is. And then the salesman, who was a friend of mine, whispered in my ear and said, don't buy right now. A new model is coming out. Well, I didn't want to hear that. I wanted to buy right now. He said, don't buy right now. A new model is coming out and also there will be rebates. So it's better to wait. Well, I didn't want to hear wait. I wanted to hear now. We love, in today's society, instantaneous results and instantaneous satisfaction. Well, I waited, and thank God that I did. Sometimes, the hardest thing to do is to wait. It says in Psalms 37, verse 9, Those that wait upon the Lord shall inherit the earth. Well, what that means is that you're going to inherit all the good things, the better things that you would have never had had you just gone ahead on impulse. This is especially true, my friend, when we're in a hurry and when we want things to happen now, if not sooner. God's plan doesn't always unfold in the way that we'd like or the speed that we would like it to. We often hear about God's speed and we think that's super fast, faster than light. Not necessarily. It is a divine timing speed. As thoughtful men and women that trust in a loving, all-knowing God, we must learn to wait patiently for God to reveal and to work out God's plan for our lives. We humans know precisely what we want and we know exactly when we want it. We don't always know, though, what is best. God does. God has a perfect plan for each of our lives and we simply need to trust God, trust God enough to wait and let God work it out in God's perfect timing. And after all, God is trustworthy all the time, and God knows what is best all of the time.